when you invite people towards establishing salah and offering salah, what you actually need to do is you need to tell them that salah itself is a source of forgiveness and purification from all the sins. Introduce to them the words of Prophet Salaam where he promises and he tells us and informs us from all these things. Hazrat Abu Huraira radiallahu ta'ala who reports in Bukhari and Muslim that Prophet Salaam was with his companions and he asked, Tell me that if a stream flows at the drawer of any person and he takes a dip in it five times a day, will any grime or dirt be left on his body? And all the companions said, no dirt or grime will be left on his body at all. And then Prophet ﷺ explained, it is the same with the five daily prayers. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala removes sins and impurities to the law. Similarly, Hazrat Abu Zar radiallahu ta'ala who has reported in Mustad Ahmad that Prophet ﷺ said he was out on a cold weather and there he saw a tree with all the leaves were dried out and he shook the branches and the trees started falling and he said that when a person offers salah solely for the sake of Allah, his sins fall away like these leaves. And this is exactly how we need to introduce the concept of Salah and the importance and the excellence of Salah in people. There is so much of ignorance and people just don't realize the importance and excellence of Salah and the reward of Salah. And also don't they realize the punishment of leaving Salah.